Hi, my name is Arsha Mullah. I am a student of MIT ISPJ and this is a podcast on how digital activism impacted the social lives of people with the contextual project. Technology is accelerating the rate at which ideas, relationships and information are shared. As such, social media is revolutionizing communication and access to information on both national and global scale. Mass distribution and the ability to effortlessly share information has influenced many facets of modern life, changing the way we think about, connect to, and engage with social justice and activism. People have discovered new ways to communicate and collaborate through social media. Features such as feeds, profiles, and groups on social platforms provide global access to organizations that can promote and increase visibility by sharing and networking. Modern communication students study these virtual platforms and can even pursue careers creating and distributing digital content. The power of social media can amplify Voices instantaneously spread information and increase collaboration across diverse groups of people. The media participating in media activism includes newspapers, video and audio media, campaigns and protests regarding media and communication policies. This part of activism is used in many forms in diverse fields. To spread that information which has not been given space in the censored news or mainstream media. The basic focus of this activism is to bring change in the policies that relate to media as well as communication technologies. Social media activism is a form of media activism which brings in a larger audience because of its interactive features towards a great mass. The information that breaks in social media becomes viral in a fraction of seconds. The campaigns and the protests related information on social media can increase the number of supporters. Thus, social media is far superior than traditional media. There are various social media platforms like WhatsApp, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram where a piece of information can become trending in no time. Though it is true that a small percentage of social media users express their personal interest in a cause online as compared to offline mode, the social media interaction stands as the first step towards social engagement. In the words of Victor the Mosso, the participant of Sao Paulo's main Paulister Avenue, social media has helped us organize without having leaders. Our ideas, our demands are discussed on Facebook. There are no meetings, no rules. Today everyone has smartphones on which various social media apps can be operated for free. There are various apps too which offer live streaming. All this stuff has contributed a lot to social media activism. With the improvement in communication technology, information can be widespread without any error. With the help of videos being uploaded on YouTube, information can be sent more easily as compared to publishing of information in native language. Thus, it can be defined as the activism behind the screen. Most of the information is intentionally changed to trending by tagging a great number of people or by using hashtags or simply through location check-ins. These are the best ways to put forth one's opinion about that particular information. Thus, the duplicity of the information sets in the viral category. This also allows the like-minded people to come together and the unlike-minded people to share their personal opinions. Social media platforms such as Instagram, Facebook and Twitter help the user to engage with the trending causes. This is done via liking, subscribing, tagging, sharing, hashtag videos or photos. Some of the famous trending causes include hashtag me too, hashtag hokoropo, hashtag not in my name, etc. This type of engagement has caused increase in social media activism and therefore has impacted social lives of people to have more freedom 
to share their words, views and opinions. Thank you.